Hey guys, welcome to the vault. We are back with some more exclusive content. Jason, Leon, and Pierre uh, here to bring you some um, exclusive preview. Um, this is a segment that was uh, heavily requested to come back. So here we are. Uh, Hat Heaven dropped for July 11th. Um, Pierre, take it away. Well, listen, I mean, they can request all they want. Unless Hat Heaven's <laughs> dropping hats, we can't do this segment. So we, uh, well, I guess, we, guess we just got to take over Hat Heaven's store and just decide when they drop from now on. Yeah, I guess. But like, this is going to be a pretty crazy drop, man. I mean, this is a large drop. So this is all going to be dropping on Monday. So if you're watching this at time of release, it's Saturday evening. Um, but on Monday, uh, July 11th, these hats will drop at 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So we're not going to rank these or anything. We're just going to go through each of them and just really talk about them. This is a big drop. So without further ado, fellas, let's get started. All right. So starting here, we got that uh, Minnesota Twins and that Seattle Mariners. Uh, Jason Meads, like, um, I, I don't know, like this would be like your – your wife, if a logo could be a wife, this would be it. So that, um, that, that that's me in logo form, is what that is. Oh, okay. All right. All right. Round and curvy. What? <laughs> Leon, that and, sounds like you. Yeah, I might have <laughs> to go hit, curvy. I might have to go hit the gym. I'm I I'm probably more shaped like that ass than Jason. Yeah. Yeah. Jason, more Jason's more of the the TC on the side. Yeah. yeah no, he's more <laughs> the T. The T. He's just the T. He just stands like yeah. this. Yeah. Uh, so what are you guys thinking here? I like these two hats. I, mm -hmm. I, I like the, I like Seattle better, but yeah, that the Twins is a you know go, Golden Gophers. Yeah. Um, yeah, it looks like the, they were reverse. It looks like yeah, yeah, these are both winners in my book. I love that patch too on the Twins hat, but yeah, that's one. That's the that's the best All Star Game patch for the Twins for sure. Mm -hmm. But that right. yeah, that's that Seattle will be coming home. Mm. All right, so let's take a look at the next slide, guys. I love this Red Sox. It's like a city Ooh. connect feel to it. That's double up territory for me. One to wear, one to save. Um, hey, White Sox, that, look look to the left, and that's how you do a Sox logo. That's a Boston cool looking logo. logo. Yeah. I like that white that White Sox logo though. Before it became like before it was everywhere, I liked it. I don't like it at all. Uh, it looks like it, they just like cut it out of a newspaper and glued it to the front of the hat. Wow. Someone's getting yeah. crankier as the evening progresses. Leon, what are your thoughts here? <laughs> um, I do, I do <coughs> like the Boston one. Like you're saying, it reminds me of the city connect a little bit. Um, they didn't use such a light blue. It's a little bit of a darker blue, but yeah, it's, it's a, it's a cool hat. And, uh, I think I'm closer to Jason. Um, on the white, so I'm not a huge fan of that White Sox logo. It has some cool elements with like the the winged sock, I guess, but I'm kind of over that logo in particular. Mm. Thank All you, right. Leo. Well, wow, you finally agreed on something, you two. All yeah. right, why don't we um why don't we uh continue on here? All right, we got uh Philadelphia Phillies and a New York Mets cap. These are really plain, but also very cool. I mean, just mm -hmm. Clean to the point, gray bottoms at per usual. These are great. Yeah, this is like the third or fourth different colorway that Phillies have. Yeah, yeah. Logo yep. There was a, there was a. I think there was a green, a yellow. I want to say like a, a blue. There might be navy. more than that. Yeah, yeah, black and red too. I think. Mm. Yeah, very solid. Yeah, solid. These are like daily wears. Something oh, yeah. you yeah. pop on. That's what I love yeah. about having. I mean, just. Just pop on these when you're going out the door. You're going to look good. Can't go wrong with these, man. Mm -hmm. All right, let's move on, guys. Mm. All right, I like that Chicago one a lot. I, I love that C. That's just something I, I seem to like. But what's what's up with the Milwaukee one? What's that about? Uh, Nothing. Just light royal blue Milwaukee brew Braves. Do you like that thing? I do. I do. Yeah, I like it. They're both clean hats. What do you like, Lee? Here, Leon, you liking either of these? I like the Chicago one a lot. I mean, uh, anytime you do like any type of Chicago team in the the flag Chicago colors, colors. Yeah. yeah, I think it really works. Um, you, I do like that stuff in black and red or white and black normally, but 
um, the the flag would be really cool too. So I like that one. Mm. All right, let's see what's next. Ooh, I like that Chicago even better. Mm -hmm. It's like an olive, right? Yeah. Olive always looks nice with red, right? The red really pops yeah, off. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, it pops off it nicely. And that Washington hat is clean. It's not like my yeah. favorite that we've seen so far, but certainly is a clean cap. Yeah. Kind of similar to the Chicago one we just saw. Add a side patch, but similar, mm -hmm. similar color palette, but um yeah it's all oh the other chicago didn't have a side patch no side patch yeah that was a plain yeah. plain jane yeah another two good hats i like the chicago best though mm -hmm. all right what's all right. up next let's see Ooh. oh yes yeah. scripts the Royals, I, I'm into. The Angels, I've been there, done that kind of. It's not that yeah. it's not a good hat. It's just like I, I have stuff like that. But that Royals, I like a lot. Oh, I, like, I really like that Royals. That might be my second favorite hat of the drop. My first favorite so far is the Red Sox. My, mine's Seattle. Yeah. I don't know. That might be one of the, the White Sox ones, I think. Maybe the Olive one. Mm. So far, this really is clean. I still think we got a couple more left. So, all right, let's take a look. What's next? Ooh, the fourth installment of the White Tiger. Yeah, the albino tiger. So there was. Uh, you had Lakeland, Oni Oniata. You Detroit. had Detroit walking through the D, right? And now this mm -hmm. one. Mm -hmm. I will not be completing the set. I'm completing it. Oh, I'm completing that. Set. We're seven deep. You may as well. You may as well go four. Uh, I don't know. I just I do not like that logo because even you got to add it to the collection, man. Got to add even it to the collection. Even though he did the albinos, he also did them in regular color too. So it's really eight caps deep almost now. Mm. No, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna draw a line in the sand. I'm not ever buying that logo. I love this. All logo. right, man. It's so ugly. It's cool. <laughs> it's no, nope. it's so ugly. It's downright ugly. I'd buy this a hundred times over that hat you picked as your sleeper this week. It's because you don't know good hats, Pierre. <laughs> you know <what> good hats. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's cute, Jason Mead, but <laughs> nah. But I, I'm doing. I'm getting it. I don't want this logo is definitely ugly, but I got to get it to complete that collection. Yeah, you know me. I'm a collector. Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! You're All gonna right. convince me to get this logo. You have to if you already got the other three, man. You got to get it. Uh, Come I'll on, man. It. I'll think about it. All right, let's see it. what's next. Thoughts here, fellas? So I really want to like the Atlanta one. I feel like that one almost should have been a plain chain. I, I agree. It might sound blasphemous to the, the hype beasts out there. But... um. I feel like this is a situation where the side patch actually adds, uh, doesn't add much to the hat. It takes away from that. I agree with you. It, mm -hmm. it, you take the side patch off of that, and that's that's a winner. I don't know. I it's just, all, all three of us are in agreement, but I still think it's a good hat. But yeah, I think it would yeah, be better without the side patch. It's definitely a good hat. I don't know. Is is that? Maybe it's just because the side patch looks too big. I don't know. I, don't I feel know. maybe it's like it doesn't tie into the front at all. It's got red. Was yeah. the front got yellow? I don't know. I don't know what it is, but yeah, um, I'm with you. Something's yeah. not fitting there. Yeah, uh, pur purple and gold Marlins is pretty cool. I do like that. Mm -hmm. That Marlins logo is one of my favorites, man. Mm -hmm. All right. All right. Getting towards the end, I think, if not the end. So that Detroit Tigers is listed as a Samba. Mm. Whatever that means. Does that mean anything samba. to anyone? No, I like that it's not a weird color. I like that it's not a weird color, though. No. It's a, yeah, a little lighter like a orange. Gold. It's or like a gold, gold yeah. Almost. Yeah, it's like a metallic, I think. Mm -hmm. That's um, kind of cool. That Diamondbacks one reminds me a lot of the Dune uh, hook he did. It was like a um, like a beige or a tan. In almost the same colorway, do you remember? We remember. Yeah, I do you remember. Bring that. it up every time you you see a Diamondbacks with a blue logo. 
Just, just when he did it, that one, and told us it was hooked to Dune. But all right. Rumor has it. Rumor, rumor has, has it. it. Uh, this, this was based off of a Dune. No, I didn't say that. I just said it reminds me of that. Hat. Oh, that's just the rumor. Yeah. yeah. This is a, that is a good looking hat, though. It is. Huh? It's been a solid drop so far. Is this all of them? Yeah. No. No. Oh, there's, there's the one. Yeah, the DC. People have been nice. talking about this DC hat for ever have since they? he. Yeah, he posted it in his story like last week, and people have been like clamoring for it. Really? Mm-hmm. It reminds me of, like Daredevil almost. It's a it's a nice looking hat. Well, sure. that DC logo does have a Daredevil feel to it. It mm-hmm. does. The interlocking D and D. And the Tampa Bay one is a very clean hat. That's a that's a collection filler. Mm-hmm. More good stuff. This is a good drop, man. Mm-hmm. You got another Orioles and Ravens colors. Yeah, and I don't Garrett know why I like that one so much. I like that two tone San Francisco hat. It's like a Gucci colorway, right? Almost. Yeah, I like it. Yeah, yeah these are. So I'm good. not sure if this. I like the other Ravens hats better, but this is a good one if you got if you already got the other ones kind of put together. Yeah. This is another one you got to get. Is that the you think it's the third one he did? Yeah, Baltimore. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I would think so, right? I remember two vividly. I'm I'm not sure if there's more. the The viewers will let us know. No, I think this is the third one. New York, New York. A couple more Mets caps. You got that '86 World Series. You they beat the Red Sox. Is that black? I feel like it's midnight navy. It's black it like metallic it's Yankee colors. Yeah. yeah, it's black metallic here. It says in '86 World Series. Okay, mm. solid. Mm. All right. I like it. And then the three color logo. They, they changed the color blocking. Is it normally that those colors? No, right? Because usually on a blue hat. I think the blue is usually on the inside, and the white's on the outside. Mm, that's a cool change. Yeah. Yeah, solid. And that's it. All right. Use code VFTV10 for 10% off your hat have an order. It's one of the uh, perks of being a Views in the Vault viewer. And, guys, this is a good drop. This was an excellent drop. I mean, very solid to the point, you know. I mean – one more can you ask for? Hat Heaven's been doing this for a long time, and they continue to do great stuff. Um, this is a deep drop. I think if you want to hit on something, you have a very good chance of hitting on something here. Yeah, there's nothing think, really really panic in here. Um, no, I think it's a very balanced drop. Yep. Yeah. If you don't have a swinging tiger yet, um, this is a good one to get. Yeah, yeah. this one's pretty cool. It's a nice calm one, right? Mm-hmm. I'm trying to think, is there any hat in here that might? Well, Jason was saying the Washington one people are going crazy for. So maybe... Yeah, but I just, I mean, that's just some of the chatter I've seen on our Discord. Um, yeah. I don't know how far that carries down through the community, right? Like, so it's, it's, it's got a lot of, a uh, lot of good qualities to it. Metallic logo yeah. and stuff. Nah, I mean, um, it's a good drop. But there's no Astros hats. So, and no Bison. So, no panic right now. Well, listen, I think, um, I, guys, this was another good uh, drop from Hat Heaven. Again, Brian, thank you for allowing us the opportunity to preview your product. We love it. Uh, Jason and Leon, thanks for joining me. Um, this was another fun evening of recording. Um, mm-hmm. And with that, Leon, big fella, take us away. Yeah, Let us know in the comments which of these hats uh, you'll be gunning for on um, July 11th at 5 p.m. Uh, shout out to the people who always ask us when and where these hats uh, always drop. Even though we put it in the comments, um, drop a like on the video, um, subscribe to the channel. Uh, for Jason Leon and Pierre, we're signing out, guys. Stay fit. See everybody. Peace. Enjoy 15% off all products with the code VFTV15. Brought to you by VFTV.